Wendy here from Draw So Cute. In this video, I'm going to show you how to draw my Draw So Cute Mavis from Hotel Transylvania. So let's get started. With Mavis, we're going to first start by drawing her bangs. So, but right here, we're going to draw a big curve that comes down. So right here, draw a curve like that. And we're going to start right here and go up and curve it out like that. So basically we just made this curve down and up if you wanted to start from this side. But this is the basic shape for her bangs. And so then from here, about right here, we're going to draw a curve that comes down. So right here, draw a curve like that. And so come over to about right there and draw the same curve on the other side like that and basically we're going to start to draw her hair that winds around so come down here and we're going to curve it up like that so same thing other side come over and curve it up like that and so from here now we can draw her face and connect these two so right here draw start by following this curve go all the way Draw a curve, so same thing, curve down like that and connect it like that. So now that we have her face in, we can start to draw her hair. Let's finish her hair first so this doesn't look really weird. <laughs> this looks pretty weird, right? And um, so let's go up to the center, so about right here. And we're going to draw some zigzags where the hair that's on top of her head that kind of uh, sticks out. So about right here, we're going to draw one, two, three. Very random like that, just three zigzags. And so from here, let's curve it all the way down and bring it in and connect it like that. So just remember, curve it down with a big curve. So let's do the same thing on the other side. Curve it down and come in and connect it. Much better on this side. It's always easier for a right-hander to draw this side than that side. <laughs> and um, so now we can go in with some details. So come out right here. We're going to basically draw another curve that comes connects to right here. So about right here, we're going to draw another curve and connect it in like that. And now we can draw her ears. So draw her ears like that, her big ears that kind of come out. And so let's do the same thing on the other side. So about right there, I'm going to draw a curve and comes in like that. Same thing, her ear, come over about right there like that for her ear. And then you can draw some details if you want to make some lines like that. And another one like that. And right here, let's not forget we need to draw a little bit lines right here just so we can see her hair, just some details of her hair for the side like that. And maybe one more like that for some details. And so now we can go and draw her face, her very cute little face. So right here we're going to give her two big draw so cute eyes. So two circles. And one more. Like that. <laughs> Hands are all wobbly today. And so two circles inside for um, highlights, a curved line at the bottom, and a shade in the top. And almost done. and lines at the bottom like that. So same thing here, two small circles and curve line at the bottom, oops, like that and shade in the top. So many of you know you've been asking me how I color it and I color it in a program called Photoshop and on the computer and the reason is because it's a lot easier where I can play around with colors and also, I can fix really bad mistakes like that, so I get to cheat afterwards and clean it all up. And um, 
So here, let's give her her eyelashes. So with um, Ma uh, Mavis, I decided to try something new. So her lashes are not gonna curve like all the princesses that I've done. It's just gonna be straight. So do one, two, three, like that. And you can come back in and uh, just kinda thicken it. And at the bottom, let's do the same thing. One, two, three. A little bit smaller and shorter. So same thing, other side. One, two, three, and go in and thicken, thicken it. And at the bottom right here, two, three small ones like that. Hope you guys like this eye. And her uh, Mavis eye kind of inspired me to try this out. And I think it looks pretty cute, right? So I might use that for other eyes, <laughs> for other girls. So now right here, let's draw um, her eyebrows. So we're just gonna do a soft curve that kind of runs into under her bangs. So same thing right here. And curve it down like that. And let's give her a cute little smile. So right here, little smile and cap it off like that. And so now let's go in and draw her cape. So find the center again about right right here and we're gonna draw a um, kind of like a two angle lines right here but instead of a V we're just gonna connect it like that and so then right here at this point right here we're gonna draw two circles like that and now we can flare it out for her cape for her collar area so kind of about right here and then come out, flare it out like that and connect it. So same thing with her side. So about right there, we're gonna draw a curve that comes in like that and goes up like that for her um, cape because she's a vampire. And uh, so now we're gonna, from right here, we're gonna draw a curve, very simple, comes down and flares out. And same thing, other side, come down and flare it out and now come from this circle right here we're going to connect it a curve like that and same thing other side curve and connect it and now from right down about right here we're going to connect it with another curve and basically that's her dress that's inside and so we don't we're not gonna draw our hands because we don't see it they're under her cloak makes the drawing much easier right <laughs> so now find the center again but right here and we're gonna draw her legs so very simple like that and from this center part again come out for her other leg and angle like that and we're gonna draw this leg first so cap it off with a curve line like that and we're gonna draw her shoes. So same, come in, come out, and connect it like that. So same thing here, let's connect it with a curve. Come out, and we come down with an angle, come down, and then come out a little bit for her heel. And we're gonna draw her shoe, very simple shoe, her uh, canvas shoes, I think that's what they're called, right? And so now some details, some curve like that and her laces two three if you want it so right here another curve and her laces two three like that and bottom right here for her shoe like that and so now we can draw oops I forgot the back the back of her cape so let's finish her cape right here the back and just curve it around and Curve it and connect it like that. And so we can go in with some details for her, the stripes in her um, leggings. So right here, just gonna very randomly try to even as possible, just draw all these stripes that go all the way across like that. Oops, I guess I cleaned that up when I color it. <laughs> and so right here, same thing, go up two, keep going, and one more like that. 
so that's for the leggings. And so if you want it, you could also um, put some fangs on her. So I'm going to switch to a thin Sharpie just because I don't want my thick Sharpie to mess it up. But right here, to make her a vampire, you can just draw two little fangs right here. So like that, kind of like a V. And one more like that. <laughs> for her Mavis from Hotel Transylvania. Hope you like this uh, drawing. Thanks so much for watching and please subscribe to get updates on more Draw So Cute videos. See you.